this day, let us recognize uh, women who are first among first. Lottie Holman O'Neill. She was born in 1878 and uh, chose to raise her family in Downers Grove of DuPage County. Inspired by the success of Jeanette Rankin of Montana, the first woman elected by the U.S. House of Representatives, Lottie O'Neill ran for the Illinois House of Representatives and became the first woman to ever grace this chamber as an elected legislator in 1922. She supported putting women on juries, state-assisted uh, assistance for disabled children, and eight-hour work days. She fought issues that we're still fighting today against abusive income taxes, growing state budgets, and public corruption. She foresaw the damage that would follow national policy proposals and set the stage for issues that continue to divide us today. She retired from the Illinois legislature on January 8th of 1962 at the very young age of 84. O'Neill served in 19 different general assemblies. Her 40 years of service as a woman in the legislature is matched by only one, Barbara Flynn Curry. Upon her retirement, um, Wait a second here, this is not right. Um, upon her retirement, she declined an invitation to have her statute in the Illinois State House Rotunda. She didn't want it to be facing the scoundrel who defeated her in her 1930 Senate primary. On this day in women's history, let's acknowledge one of our own who broke the mold and started a tradition of strong and vibrant women in Illinois politics, Lottie Holman O'Neill. Thank you.